hi guys so if you don't drifting like this in some direction like this so i'll tell you the trouble shooting how to fix it so guys on to the first part now so the basic problem is you need to calibrate the gyros of your drone and to do that you have different functionalities in your remote control so i will tell all the functionalities which you need to perform to calibrate the gyros so first of all you need to pair the drone to pair you know that you just need to turn on this drone turn on the drone uh, turn on the uh, this remote control as well up down and it is paired now it is paired and now you can calibrate it to calibrate it there are uh, very dissimilar functions in different type of remote controls so the first is you just need to push these button down like they are meeting like this or you can also do like this and even this and also pushing the throttle downwards so these are the four to five type of uh, calibration in a drone different type of drone uh, has different calibration in their remote control and after it is calibrated i will show you i will need to listen the voice so as i have this calibration button you can see so if you have this calibration button then that is good you can just press this button and you can see the light of the drones it is flashing and now it is calibrated so by this way it is calibrated now we'll test it if it is flying or not if it is still drifting so you can see it is still drifting it's not helping the cause so now we'll move on to the second step so now on to the second step so you, it was visible that our drone was drifting in this direction it was right direction so we will keep anything just below the uh, these uh, stands these legs of the drones and now we'll calibrate the drone and see if it is fine or not so remote is on drone is paired and now we will press the calibration button so now we will see if a drone is still drifting or not so guys unfortunately it's a motor problem for me and if i have told the steps if those work for you then well and good best of luck to you for flying but uh, my drone is not flying because there is a problem with the motor so if there is a problem with the motor you can just uh, unscrew everything and you can test it out but uh, you have to get a motor so if you can replace it well and good but as of now i don't have any motor so i won't open it i just need to check out the motor and i'll upload a video of how to change the motor and all so one thing what you can do is you can see that the propeller is this is the b4 and again it's the b4 a3 and a3 and in the other drones as well you can see this is a b and b a and a again b b a and a so first you need to check out that are your drones matching so what you need to do is you need to see the number of the uh, propeller b b they have to cross they have to be in the cross like x it is forming a x a and a other b same here a and b so check out that your drone propellers are in the right position or not so this is one other cause and also if your drone is tilting toward this side what you can do is you can bring those two propellers to this position and these two propellers to that position so it may work this is one other cause which is uh, a major reason why your drone is tilting and other reason is that your drone many rookies do this they are not placing a drone on a very horizontal surface it is either like this either like this it has to be placed so your accelerometers are in a right shape so it can fly to this like if your drone will be like this so it will drift like this so this is one error which many people do lastly guys i needed to mention it earlier as well but i am really sorry so you can also check the damage in your propellers like in my drone the propeller are just fine you can see if the propellers are broken 
from this edge from this edge from any edge if they are broken you just replace it because a malfunction propeller will also just tail the drone for you and last there is a trim option so before you go to the motor part you can do the trim option as well if your drone is not getting calibrated and if the method which i told you like if you place the drone on a surface if your drone is tilting towards this side and if you place the drone like this and calibrate it may work but if it is not working at all then that that means that your drone is not really stable the build in your drone that is not stable so it is getting malfunctioned so in that case you can trim the drone as your last option before checking onto the motor part to trim the drone these are the trim keys so if your drone is tilting toward this side you need to press this button until it is stable if it is tilting toward this side you need to press this right trim button until it is trimmed if it is going uh, uh, forward you need to press this backward trim button if it is coming backward you need to press this forward button until and unless it is trimmed so these are the things which you need to check when your drone is tilting i hope you liked my basic video if you did like please subscribe to my channel because i'll be coming up with more troubleshooting videos of drone as well so stay tuned for more bye bye for now so i'm really sorry guys that i have to make another shot of the video the problem is that i am here to just tell you about the motor shortage or the problem with the motor so here i am and now to test if the motor is fine or not we need to do one thing you can see our drone is paired and now you need to check if what motor is rotating and what motor is not rotating so in this you can see it is rotating okay oh my god i'm sorry sorry in this also the gear is rotating you can see i'm not sure if you can see or not the gear is still rotating because you can see the fan is on so means the gear is rotating we we'll check this one so the gear is rotating as you can see now we we'll check this one the gear is still rotating no the gear is not rotating so that means this motor is faulty maybe we'll check it out and this gear is again rotating so you can see the propellers are on so now we will plug it off and we'll check the issue now you can see this was the faulty motor this propeller was not spinning so as you can see this is the gear okay let me get a good angle this is the gear you can see the white one and there is a gear on the upside you can see this one this white one so make sure that this gear is touching the gear of the propeller that is how it will rotate so you can check it out if if that is rotating if that gear is rotating if this gear is rotating this white one that means your motor is fine if not then there is a problem with the motor so in our case the motor is not rotating so in that case you can replace the motor or if this is rotating and the propeller on the upside it's not rotating so you need just need to adjust it and make sure that it is touching the upward uh, you can say gear so if not then if you can change the motor well and good you can change that but if you're not really confident like me then you can go to a technician he will surely change it for you you will get it uh, done for around 100 to 200 rupees depending upon the availability so hope you liked it and hope all your problems drone queries uh, will be solved in this video if not please uh, just give a comment in the section below and i'll surely try to answer all so stay tuned for more videos bye bye